I'm Naomi Kellogg. It's Today in Lighting, Wednesday, 15 November. I'm filling in for Randy Reed, who is traveling. We're sponsored by Advance by Signify, the name and quality lighting components. If you enjoy Today in Lighting, please hit the like button and subscribe. Here are the stories making news. In the third quarter of 2023, Applied UV reported 11.4 million in revenues, making a substantial 94.8% surge compared to the same period in 2022. Details on Edison report. Applied UV also priced a larger public offering, now set to raise around 6.4 million, up from 6 million. The goal is to repay debts and cover general expenses. It's due to close on 16 November. More on Edison report. World leaders representing 147 major economies at the Minamata Convention on Mercury in Switzerland have consented to phase out fluorescent lamps by 2027, essentially concluding the industry except for specific purposes. We ring the Ricolite story on Deal Global. Dark Sky International announced the 2023 award winners, honoring dedicated individuals, groups, and communities for their exceptional efforts in preserving nighttime environments. Check out the winners on Designing Lighting. Amerlux announced that its 3 inch Charisma Linear Pendant and 3 inch Solus Downlight Collection won a pair of industry competitions judged solely by peer designers and specifiers at the recent IES Philadelphia 2023 Slots and Dots Expo Showdown. Congratulations, and check out more details on Edison Report. CADID North America is seeking to fill a chief commercial office position to lead sales and marketing in their territory. Details on Edison Report. Yesterday, the Dow was up 489 points. NASDAQ increased by 326 points, and LSI Industries gained 5%. That's it. Go light up the world. Have a great day. Pray for peace.